Hi, I'm about to show you how to use WebWave Website Builder to create a unique website with its own original content, special effects and animations. We can begin with a blank page and start from scratch or use a template. This one looks nice, but it's for a watch store and we're about to sell bikes. No worries, we're gonna change everything in a second. This is the WebWave Website Builder. Let's check out its features and possibilities. On the left side, we have panels that we can use to add new elements. There's also a plus button to add groups of elements that later we can easily incorporate into our project. At the top, we can change which sub page we want to edit. Right next to this list, we have three icons. If we click them, we can change in between different screen sizes. To do this, we can also use the sliders on the sides of the page. Perfect. On the top right is the Publish button, just one click away from being part of the web. Below, there are Setting and Layer panels. They are pinned now, but you can just click and drag them wherever you want. Make yourself comfortable. Let's change the text on our website. To do this, I just have to click on the header and type my own title. You can move the element with one pixel precision, no grid, frames and tables required, just like in advanced graphic design programs. Now let's click on the background photo. In the setting panel, we can choose edit content and it's gonna send us to the free image bank to choose some dynamic picture of a cyclist. This one looks great. Unfortunately, this picture is way too bright for our text to look good, but we can fix that. Once again, we go to the setting panel and in filters, we can find the brightness slider. Yeah, that's much better. Okay, now it's time for some special effects. Let's surprise our visitors. Let's add the parallax effect to our background picture. Now, our cyclist is gonna ride up and down the bike while you scroll the page. Let's also change the watch picture for a bike with a transparent background. Now, let's make some space. Just with one click, you can move the chosen element and everything underneath it so that we can make some space for additional content. And I think that it's time to add more content to our website. How about some buttons? I choose a button and scale its size. We don't want any color here, just some pictures. Let's set off background color and add an image instead. From image bank, we choose this guy and add our own text. Now let's change the hover button settings. Let's add some shadow in the style section. The color should be darker and let's set the blur for 20 pixels. What's next? Another button. Let's copy and paste the first one. Now let's change the text to woman and add a new picture. In settings, we change the background image. Good. But you know what would be even better? If the buttons could lead us somewhere. In settings, we go to click action section and choose an action. Then from the list of sub pages, we choose the right one. Repeat that with the other button. Let's make some space and use some pre-made element groups. I think we should add testimonials. Just click once and they're gonna jump right into your website. Magic. Now let's change the text quickly. And from the setting panel, Let's choose some animation on show. Normally, we can stay here a little longer because we've got plenty of options. We can set the duration, choose type of animation. It's important to make good impression, right? Let's add some sort of background to our opinions. To do this, let's pick a shape and set its width as a 100%. In the layers panel, let's move this element under opinions. Great. Moving on to the bottom of our website, there's the footer. Elements that you can see on every sub page are in the pink border. You can see that also in the layer panel. Every element that is a part of a footer is in pink. The footer we can edit easily. Just change the text. Now our client will know how to contact us. I think we're all said and done here. So I'm just gonna click publish and our website is online. Let's see what the website looks like. The parallax effect is just perfect and the text is so visible because we've changed the brightness of our image. The buttons encourage you to click them. Below is the testimonial section that is animated on show. That's it! The website looks just how I wanted it to. It's really impressive. In the next video, I'm going to show you how to adjust it to mobile devices. And once again, we're going to do it in less than 5 minutes. Thank you and see you later. Bye!